This segment brought to you by Heinen Brothers Ag. Farmers helping farmers by offering quality aerial and ground application, fertilizer, ag chemicals, and anhydrous ammonia. Call today to protect your crop yield. Hi, I'm Ken Bowl uh, with NRCS. A lot of times they'll, they'll call us with a resource concern, whether it be uh, soil erosion or out in the pasture with brush or needing better grazing management or additional water. And uh, with the soil erosion, a lot of times just doing no-till will take care of a lot of the sheet and rill erosion. Yeah, this field's flat, so we're not worried about the, the gully erosion, but on the steeper soils, we would have a gully erosion where, we, where a technician would, would go out and uh, we'd make a plan. And, and usually a lot of times we'll put in terraces and waterways. We used to do a lot of those anymore. We're doing quite a few, but not as many as we used to. We're getting pretty good coverage in the counties. And I was helping out one of the producers here in the, on the county line between Saline and Dickinson County with a uh, sorghum yield contest. Hi, I'm Mark Pettijohn with Kansas Jag Limited. We're standing in one of my sorghum fields that did have a little bit of aphid damage, but nothing beyond the threshold. A little bit of headworms. Uh, we did not spray for either. Uh, this field was planted June 3rd with uh, Pioneer brand 84G62. It was fertilized at that time with a 12, 20, a little bit of sulfur, a little bit of zinc starter fertilizer. Um, it was also side dressed with a rolling applicator uh, on June 11th after it was newly emerged. And what's interesting is it's actually out yielding the other half of the field that was strip tilled and fertilized March 1st. The chemical program here was done in two split applications, the first being April 15th. It was 1.25 quarts of Lumax and the other was the day of planting which was June 3rd. Also 1.25 quarts of Lumax following the planting. Um, this field was this year's in obviously sorghum. Last year it was planted to corn and then it was overflown with a uh, cover crop uh, about the time right before corn was harvested and there was a, a nice cover crop out here that was uh, got a foot or two tall and then froze out when winter came. And uh, so that's a great way to get good residue in the, an organic matter in the soil. Last year we won the state no-till contest with 155 and I think that's about what this field should do this year. I'm, uh, the red milo is doing better than the yellow milo and I'm pretty optimistic. Soil is the life of a farm, and for 25 years, SureCrop Liquid Crop Nutrition has helped growers produce abundant quality crops while preserving and improving the soils they steward. SureCrop offers complete soil and plant analysis with cropping recommendations, delivery direct to your on-farm storage, and quality crop nutrition custom blended for your field. Choose SureCrop for the assurance of excellence for your soil. Call today or visit their website for more information.